How do we have that many sick people? That's impossible. We've got 5,000 sick si Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Uh, do you guys tell me anything? I think we've got the plague. Uh, I think maybe the sewage system. Let's shut down this water work here just in case it's causing a problem. Let, let me build another water plant there. Hook it up and then decommission this one. Okay, right. And this one... No, let's just move it. Yeah. Okay, that's done. So why are so many people sick and dying? Come on, tell me, tell me, tell me. Okay, yeah, there's this, this deforestation. I'm worried about that too. Um, fire departments. Looks like it was the water. Whoa, this is crazy. I haven't seen this. How cemetery usage is okay. Wish this this would show if the water was dirty. Okay, average health is going up. I think it was just the fact that we were pumping water that was too close to the sewage. But that put a dent in our growth pattern here. Is the water work still a problem? We've got a tweet right there. Electricity is available. Sewage seems to be alright. Uh oh, it's, 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 hold on. It's still a problem. I think we need to move this pipe. Angle it like that instead. Problem is, there's not much flow for some reason. Uh oh, uh, hold on, it's going back down. Uh, oh boy. Maybe it was just temporary. Let's go slow. No, it's, it's going back down to 19%. 18% no 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 hold on we need to open up this area can we do that yet yeah okay well I'm gonna purchase that immediately okay well uh, if uh, this movement does yeah let, let's just move them I know it costs but we need to move them uh, let's get you relocated well away from all this sewage stuff in this cove right there Okay, uh, and then we're a safe distance away from the crap, right? Right? Is this true? Please tell me health will go up now. Might take some time. Health is still going down. Oh, now it's going up. But we lost a lot from that. Uh, quite a tragedy for the city of New Seattle. Lots of dead people. But I think our actual capacity for them is fine. Uh, and, well, there's, there's a little bit of lack of retrieval over there, so let me put a symmetry on this side. We have a lot of healthcare there. What we don't have is one over here. Lots of health gear over here. Oh boy. Abandoned. Stuff is still bad. Our population is collapsing. Twitter, please tell me. Oh, Tweeter, please tell me. Okay, um. It melts the. Do we have acid rain? 
dead people in the coal power plant. A dead person in the incineration plant. Well, I won't comment on that. Um, this is bad. Oh, it's, is, is it because things are not powered? Hold on. Well, there's this power line that's doing nothing. Those seem to be powered by their own dedicated power supply. Let's get rid of the power line that's doing nothing. Not exactly the priority right now. Let's take a look at the sewage system now. Is it creeping to our other location? Well, it's sure trying. There's just no flow in this place. Landfill incineration status. Ah. We need more incinerators. Okay, um let's get a loan. Still haven't paid off that big one. Average health is ticking up. That's hopeful. But if I was hoping that this city would be larger than Sendai, I think I just crippled that possibility. What's the one with the funny symbol? I don't know what that symbol is. Low land value. Oh, I don't think that's a big problem right now. Well, maybe it's because of the incineration stuff. Well, we're getting population back and our health care. Long way to go before it's even stable. You're talking about 1,971 sick citizens out of 10,000 now. That's a lot. Certainly, building more health care facilities isn't going to do the trick. We just need better well obviously the sewage was the thing better sewage treatment we don't actually have a sewage treatment plant right now do we water treatment plant still a ways away okay we can build an incinerator now let's get it well away from the population and from our water supply I'm gonna build a dedicated road just for it. So now, Mr. Incinerator, you're going right there. Well, let's say right there. Well away from the rest of our population. Still not great. Still not great at all. We'll be able to build a crematorium at 13,000. And then a water treatment plant as well. So we're close to that. Some of it might be just too bad due to bad zoning. We could build some more office space for peoples. In other words, they might be too well educated for certain business opportunities. At least I think that's how it works. Okay, 13,000. Without any delay, I want that water treatment plant. Doesn't appear to be connected. Is it? Oh, it is. Okay. Looks like uh, not much use of the office space. I think it's time to upgrade some areas, D-zone and rezone. Starting with the commercial area near the highway. Uh, okay, they're having water problems again. It is bad. First of all, let's get another incinerator on. Oh, 
or two. Can't look like space them right. Okay, barely okay on incineration status. Now let's take a look at the sewage. Oh, it's reaching, it's reaching. Stupid treatment plant, you're supposed to be doing better than this. It's like these guys are sucking it in. Uh, we don't need a new one, we just need to relocate this one. Okay, that's online. People didn't die yet, right? Are, are people getting healthy here? Not really. Oh, th th this isn't being powered. Let's put a crematoria next to cemetery. That makes sense. Okay, water. Okay, we need more high schools up here if we want to have people working in the offices. Okay, reached a population of 16,000 Grand City. I think it was 17,000 last time, wasn't it? Okay, but important thing, solar power plants. Let's see, uh, 160 megawatts. How much is our coal power plant doing? 40. So we could decommission the two coal power plants and put online the solar. We'll just put it over here since this seems to be our electricity farm. We'll get rid of these, we'll move these guys. Maybe we should move the coal power plant, but I don't think it's really necessary anymore. Okay, so. Solar. Not exactly the friendliest place with the incineration plants, but I think it'll be alright. Let's decommission the coal power plants. That's incineration, that's coal. And this is coal. Yep. I think it'll make our citizens healthier, honestly. We have plenty of power. Let's hold off on moving the wind farms just yet. Let's see, how is this? Ah, oh, for heaven's sakes. This stuff just sucks the sewage in. We gotta create some sort of wall or barrier or something. I'm tempted to try something. Oh wait, I'm really excited about the journey. Privately funded spacecraft leave leaves Earth for the moon. I see. Oh, uh, <laughs> is it Lord Britain? Is that the the reference there? Lord British, Lord, Lord British, right? Uh, Ultima, right? The guy actually went to space. Guy who created that. Okay, well, gotta move these pronto. Let's move them over here. This is like a constant battle. Uh, let's pause while I'm doing this. Okay, back online. We're sort of leaving a trail of places we formerly put those things. But now, let's see. Well, wow, look at how the sewage is going. But hopefully this outlet will push the water so that the sewage does not creep up on it. Okay, well things are going much brighter now. Where are the garbage trucks? Uh-oh. Uh, landfill usage is pretty high now. Uh, they're all concentrated here. I guess we've got sort of a out of the way thing going there so let's get uh, another set of let's see you guys seem to be well provisioned but uh, okay I'll we seem to have a natural boundary going here so I think I'm gonna upgrade areas first rather than create new ones this strip seems to be in need of becoming high density actually let me just well, I have to run it. Okay. Okay, let's see how that works out. So, high density now. Except for this little area here. Let's take care of that as well. 
right, so we got Amity District there. I think it's pretty obvious that we've got two separate districts here now, too. So let me uh, just district this thing. What will it call this, I wonder? Glade Square. Okay. And then we have another district here. Hamilton Heights. Fair enough. Uh, not the greatest names, actually. Let's examine some of our policies now. Looks like we've got some good cash flow. A free public transport is always good. Education boost. Uh, we were doing pretty good on education on the whole. Somebody mentioned uh, land value, so I'll do parks and recreation. Recycling. Taxation, I think. Uh, tax relief for all. Okay, well that'll cut into our budget a bit, but we'll see how that flows. Okay, that's that's going pretty badly actually. Um, no, it's recovering a bit. Okay, we'll leave it alone. Uh, though there's an area here that it hasn't been districted yet. Elm District suits me fine. Okay, so that area mostly upgraded. We need more commercial, and it so happens we have got a commercial district that needs high density upgrading here. Okay, that's going well. So, this is our city 20,000 strong. Let's take a look at traffic. Well, that's pretty much as expected. Let's slow down a bit and run through everything. Power. Looking okay. You could probably afford another solar power plant. Water availability is fine. Sewage treatment. They need to show sewage separately. We need to see the sewage flow here. Let's see. Holy mackerel, it's still getting up there. Speaking of which... Uh, no, no. Healthy people. Okay, well, we're not sick yet, but the average health is not great. So let's move this guy. I need a dam of some sort. I need... I need to... Do you suppose we have enough cash to put a dam across this so that the sewage doesn't get into it. Let's let's try it. Let's see. So let's say I, I wanted to make a dam. Oh, I don't have enough money. 600. How about here? Well, we could. Horrible power production. And I'll take all our money. But in a pinch, I might have to do that. We should make use... Wow, look at that interchange. We should make use of this. The natural thing to do would be to upgrade this road, but I think we've got stuff on it. Let's see. Let me just pass the thing over to see whether it can be upgraded or not. That can, that can, that can. We can do that. No, that's a problem. We can do that portion. No. Yes. No. And that's the worst one. Because we've got a big road here. If we could actually extend it from here, it would be great. I guess we could uh, go from here. Let's see. Okay. We've got roundabouts. Hmm. 
We also got their interchange. It'd be better for me to use their interchange, honestly. I'm just not too good at it. It's important to recognize when you're inferior at something. Can we rotate it? How do we rotate things in this? Oh, it suddenly rotated all on its own. That's interesting. Whoa! Our first new interchange. Okay, um... But we need to turn this other portion into a real highway now, huh? We need a splitter of some sort. Okay, there we go. Well, not great, but hey. Make sure everything is going right. That's gonna be a busy interchange eventually. But okay, we've got a new major artery into the into the city. Okay, that should be enough development on this end. Let's get some water in. Okay, looks like we're gonna have a new district over here somehow. And looks like commerce is gonna be the first thing. But we'll need power. Good thing we're not very far away from supplies of that. That'll be an interesting place. Uh, let's see. Let's put in essential services here. That'll bridge the gap. Let's also make sure it's a pleasant place. People want to know that they'll have good property values. Oh, uh, we've got the Japanese gardens. Okay. Yes, let's have many Japanese gardens. Ooh, this place is in deep need of Japanese gardens. I think the... Where is the university? They need some leisure time, don't they? I think I've tucked it away. We need a serious beach. Let's call it a plaza, at least. But in, in SimCity 4, there was actually a beach. We need beaches. I, I, there must be a mod for it somewhere. I'm afraid there's nothing to be done for the Strawberry District. It's a lumber district. I don't think land values are going to be that great, are they? I don't know. Uh, we need... Probably it's going to be office space that we need. Let's see. Uh, we should clear some of this out and uh, reconsider our options in the middle here. Well, there's going to be one little household there. Can't do anything about that. Well, I can, but I'm not going to. Well, it looks like we gave them what they wanted. Demand has gone down. We have enormous surpluses right now. Let me make sure we don't have any loans and then we'll set upon lowering taxes here. Nope, we're clear of loans. I think uh, just residential taxes for now. High density and low density. Let's take it one little step at a time. Don't want to rush on that sort of thing. Now, public transit needs some work. I think we could do with some subway stations. Down into the Amity District. We seem to be on the major roads, but that, that that is the pattern for subways, I think. Okay, now the tunnels. Oh, we can do curves with this. I Last time I did just straight sections, and that's not good. Uh, that's not a very good curve. Okay, so we've got a nice curvy sort of thing going there. Well, not the best curve, but okay. And pretty much straight down this way. Okay, that's good. That's good. We go through this way, I think. Okay, so I think that's a solid improvement for me. I've got a actual circuit going, a 
good looking subway map for once and we will start it oh there's no power there I'll have to fix that but let's start it uh, at this one in Hamilton Heights actually okay line complete now let's get power over there best way to do that is just to build stuff let's get some good residential area in here I don't know how all my residents are doing right now. We should take a look at the tweeter. Criminals reported avoiding retina scans with contact lenses. Pre-crime division to combat crime. Okay, let's take a look at crime. Let's let's uh, let's avoid the whole pre-crime thing. Actually, um, well, nobody seems to be really hurting for a news police station, but gonna build one here anyway let's say main road uh, but that's good location right let's say here looks like we could do with another one of these here education elementary looks good High school looks good. University looks good. Landfill usage, eh. We could do with another incinerator. Water availability is solid. Water cleanliness, troubled. Well, up the river they go. Nice to have the mobile power supply for them. Hope they're alright. Looks like they really can't access the university. They've got an elementary school there. So not really expanding outward just yet. We could though. We've got the space. I think we should just line the front with residential and then eliminate the residential here and make it office space. Okay, let's get some parallel roads in here perhaps. Because we could do with another row right up front here. Okay, 25,000. We're coming up on the last 10 minutes here. It's looking good. We've got a nice seaside front. The one downside, of course, is our, our water issues. And it's getting back up there again. How many times have I relocated these things and how many times has the sewage problem crept back up on me? I think well, obviously what I should do is put the pumps on the other side, but I think they're just going to be sucking up the stuff anyway. But we'll have to buy this plot. Oh, we've reached Capital City. Yeah, we'll have to buy this plot in order to solve that problem. Now, I saw a harbor. What if we put pumps on the other side? And it sort of evens it out somehow. I wonder if that works. So uh, the sewage will become a blob in the center instead of just going to one side. Hmm. Okay, anyway, we are going to have to take a look at the harbor and that sort of thing if we continue this city. And I haven't really created a city center as such. Uh, not with all the uh, nifty, unique buildings like the space shuttle test and all that. This time, if we put a space shuttle test, I'll put it off to the side separately. So anyway, I'll consider whether to continue this city later, but I want your suggestions for future cities that we might want to try. So if you have some particular landscape that you think would be interesting for us, uh, then that is an idea I want to hear. So, but I'll have to be able to find a map for it though, that's the only thing. I think we could do with another power plant.
any other investments I want to make right now as we wrap things up. Let, let's take a look at our situation before I leave this city alone. So electricity is good, water, you know how that is. Uh, landfill usage, 75%. Probably could use another one soon, but I'll hold off on that. Well, actually, you know, the trucks will start having trouble getting to places. But putting one there isn't the brightest idea. What we need is some other far-off location that won't be obtrusive. It's tough to find, though. I definitely want to expand into this area at a high level. So I want these things to be all clean and nice. But... Maybe that's expecting too much. Anyway, I'll put another landfill over here. I guess we can connect it up here. Okay, that's good. So yeah, we will be able to get our trucks moving like that. So let's put the landfill here. Well, uh, let's keep it close to the power. Here. Edumication is okay. Altogether. I think. Sort of feel guilty about not giving them a school, but they seem to be alright with it. A little bit bad over here, though. Let's get a school here. Let's give them both an uh, elementary school and a high school. Let's get a high school there. Okay, university's fine. Okay, moving right along. Happiness. Yeah, they seem happy. You can't have perfect happiness, right? I wonder what kind. The offices love the place. Um, healthcare availability is great. Cemetery usage is solid. Um, yep, yeah, more or less. Uh, wind is located in okay places, not great. Traffic. Looks like this is the center of all of it. We've already run subways along this, but not perhaps to the full extent that we could. This seems a little bit backed up. Let's see. That's as big a road as I can put there, I think. But let's see about this, this area here. Should follow these guys and see where they're actually going. Obviously the overpass is the big thing. But at least in our city center, the traffic seems alright. It's just that people are having trouble getting to work, probably. And demand is going up. That's good to see. Anyway, uh, water stink. Uh-oh. They're complaining about that already. Okay. You know what? I think I'm going to end it here before. I, I don't want to move those things again. That will be the first thing we do if we continue this. Try and figure out... I'll hear solutions to our sewage problem. So that's that's one thing I want to hear in the comments. What should we do about our sewage problem? And, uh, I mean, do we just keep moving it up river and hope for the best? Or is there some better way of solving this? Okay, so that's something I want to know. But uh, for now, we have this city. Let's close Twitter for a sec. We have a population approaching 27,000. Uh, they're about to get a little bit sick, but we will deal with that. Anyway, so New Seattle, folks, and give me your suggestions for a different city to do next time. Again, I'll spend three hours on it and we'll see how far we get. It looks like I'm improving um, this time, even though we had that huge tragedy of many, many, many people getting sick. I managed to, I think, get a solid population underway. All right. So, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time.